Okay guys, so we are at the International Quilt Market. This is a show that is for um, quilt shop owners to go to where we can see like most of the vendors in the industry, see them in person, order new things, see things before they come out, all that see kind of stuff, new. all the new stuff. And then there's also an awesome quilt show with like quilts that have won awards and beautiful artwork. So I'm just gonna take you along with us today. We're actually on our third day here, um, but I just wanted to show you guys cause some of the booths and the quilts are really cool, very inspiring. And I'm sure we'll be sharing a lot of what we have learned here with you guys you know eventually at some point <laughs> but i'll just take you along with us today so you can see what quilt market is like okay guys so this is annie of by annie and she designs all of these different bag patterns it's so cool i'll show you the other side with all of the notions it's so inspiring and so she's going to share with us her favorite pattern that she has designed all right thank you so much kelsey i am excited to show this to you i always say when someone asks me which is my favorite pattern because i've written almost 200 patterns now wow um, which one is your favorite i said it's kind of like asking a parent who's their favorite child <laughs> but for me it's probably catch-all caddy which is this bag right here and the reason i love it is it's so very useful i have one on every work table. I have one next to my ironing board to hold my ham, my pressing bars, my turning tools, you know, my water, my spray stuff. I have one in the bathroom that holds my hair dryer and my vitamins. This is my go-to shower gift if someone's having a baby because you can fill the diapers in here, all the little creams and ointments. I have a picture of my grandson when he was just tiny sitting inside it because he loved, you know, carrying it around and putting his toys in it. But it, it has pockets that go all the way around the outside. Oh, wow, look at that. And then on the inside, can take some things out here so you can see it a little bit better instead of pockets it has these bellowed dividers which aren't attached at the bottom but that enables them to expand so for instance if you have a bottle of water that you want to put in there you put it in and it doesn't fall over as you carry it so it's got handles that you can carry it easily from room to room and people always ask what's the purpose of these I hate trying to turn the ends of binding over <laughs> and to think about doing it four times was more than I could bear. So I just kept sewing it across, but I found I really love these because it's easy to move it back and forth on my table. I'll take my ring, a key or um, zipper poles and put it on here. I put my basting tape and all those little things on a ring and put it on here. But yeah, catch all caddy. We have a smaller version of this that's over on the other side of the booth made with tiny beasts from Tula Pink that's called in control. I've got one of those next to each sewing machine and all of my tools that I need by the sewing machine go in there. But you would be amazed at how much stuff you can put in here. I took, I emptied one because I needed to send it for a trunk show and I put everything in one of those big plastic bins. That bin was this deep oh, wow. with stuff and all of that fit inside here. Wow, that's awesome. Thank you so much. You're welcome.
This is the quilt that won the Best of Show award. And I'm pretty sure every single tiny piece is made up of tiny foundation paper piece squares. And she says there are over 200,000 pieces in this quilt. How crazy is that? This one says it all for the people that aren't very woke. Yeah. <laughs> so we got all good. We have all good messages here. So this is good news, great joy. Okay. Yeah, it's not my baby. It's cute, but it's not my baby. And then here are the coordinates for him. Then our next designer here is our cover girl this time around. And so, so here. So here we are on Christmas Eve. And then Christmas Eve actually also comes with a panel. A panel in the package. And then we have it with embroidery. Or you can just buy that. There it is. Oh, so that's the Chanel. I'm used to spinning wheels. That's right. I'll pay you a Ooh! Oh, yay! Can we get the guinea collections that you saw? Okay. And we'll mail you a bundle. Okay. Well, we are exiting for the day. Goodbye, all of our pet market booths. We still have one more class to go to, but by the time our class is over, we'll have to go to the airport. So yes, we're done with the. Main. We're done. We're gonna go get another Starbucks. We've done two per day. Seems to be it's a lot. The, the quota. <laughs> yeah. If we have to go sit down right now and listen to somebody talk for like, an hour, we're going to really need a coffee. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, it's so tiring. We have a um, our flight right after this, but it's been so much fun and oh, very inspiring. I've met so many cool people and so many, seen so it's many nice new products. It's nice to talk to like, shop owners yes. and be like, oh, you too. You're, yeah. you're, you have a problem or how did you fix that or whatever. Yeah, getting but ideas. And also talking with the vendors and getting new ideas and like oh that's a lot easier than I thought it would be or okay that's glad that's I didn't do that too much. yeah <laughs> so that's yeah. why we didn't do that yeah <laughs> anyways hope you guys enjoyed our little mini vlog of one day of international quilt market and stay tuned for all the things that will be as we slowly bit by absorb bit. all yes. of the things that we've been inspired by it'll take a bit and come out with it so we'll see you guys next time see ya